everybody welcome to my channel if you're here for the first time welcome my name is Martina and for my regular viewers welcome back I did a video a few weeks ago about asking if as a black woman would you purchase a black doll for your child for your girl child right and in doing that video actually I bought that doll here locally right but I somehow I was just doing some search on Amazon and I was amazed at what I found, right? They have a line of dolls and the, these dolls are basically about, um, in my opinion, body awareness, right? And like I said in that previous video, these, um, the one that I showed, showcased that time was like a black doll with um, her natural hair, right? And it's basically for a child to be able to appreciate themselves as they are if they're a black child they color up their skin the color of their complexion some people are darker than some that sort of thing and when some people are very very dark they get very self-conscious so having a black doll you know um it helps to me it helps our child be able to more aware and appreciate themselves and uh, love themselves and love their hair and love their shape because some of the dolls that i saw are curvy big hips, nice thick calves, not the typical skinny slim Barbie that we are accustomed to know. So let me show, and I saw, let me start with the doll that I saw in doing my research. I saw this doll, it was so pretty. Only thing that she had in, similar to what it is I was looking for, is that she's a black doll and she has a hair natural, but she's generally a slim, regular Barbie doll. Let me show you this doll. And I just fell in love with her and I said I had to get this doll just for like, you know, because it was so pretty. Hold on. So here she is. Here she is. She is so pretty. I, as soon as I saw her on Amazon, every time I popped up it, I said, oh God, I have to get this doll. She is so pretty. Look at her. Look at her. And so what I will do right now, I'm going to showcase two dolls today. So one is a curvy doll and one is just this pretty one, a black doll with um, natural hair. So let me show you these dolls. I'm taking them out of the package, packages and you'll see what they look like. Okay, let's take her out of this box. But first I would just like to say that I like this casing that the doll comes in because I could always like, you know, if I have to use a doll, maybe and put her back inside of here and keep her nice and protected and also too, there's a little hook to the back you know you see that there for whatever reason i could hang this up somewhere you know and as, as since, I'm, since i'm on this topic here you can see the different dolls that are in this line i really like this one you know she's a curvy doll but I never really bothered to have it because if i keep on i'll just have all these dolls and just have them there or maybe i could just give them away I already got one I gave it to my little neighbor downstairs. So this is this one that we are discussing today. And let's get to it. <clears throat> Take her out of this casing. Put that to sit up. No. I noticed that um, in my days we had dolls that the arms were flexible and stuff. The you could bend the at the joint, you could bend them at the knees. But these dolls, her hands, her hand is like this stationary. All right. Okay. Yeah. So they're not flexible like what I used to in my days. So as you can see here, here is beautiful. You know, black woman natural hair styling. It looks pretty close to like you know. A black woman natural hair look at that pretty close she has some beautiful heart shaped earrings she's so pretty look at her complexion her dark complexion lovely and I just when I saw this doll I just was so attracted to her she's um, lovely dress with this little like orange little top spaghetti straps and like you know funky flowered I call it just like pre pants and she has a little sandals on her white sandals and yeah just velcro to the back to keep the top in place nice she is so pretty she is so pretty so i'll just show you what she looks like and i'll just put her back in a box and keep her nice and protected so this is the package in what this doll came in this curvy barbie 
It's a doll made with, made with recycled ocean bound plastic. Barbie the ocean. Let's see what she looks like. Okay, so she's out of the packaging. As you can see here, she's very curvy. She has fairly big hips, in my opinion. Well, in comparison to what the regular Barbie looks like, right? She has very curvy. She has larger legs. Her calves are bigger. If you can visualize the regular Barbies, she has very, 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 very slim legs, slim calves. You know, she doesn't have this amount of hips and she doesn't have this amount of booty either. <laughs> You know, so I like that they have decided to do a line of these dolls uh, with body awareness, you know, and it's for a child, a young child, impressionable child, you know, they could see and learn that, you know, you don't have to be like slim and skinny like Barbie and stuff, you know, um, having a beautiful figure like this curvy is all good and you're still beautiful, you know, you don't have to be skinny and, and you know, like how Barbie looks. Yeah. Okay, folks, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any comments to make on this particular topic, leave it in the comment section below and we can have a chat about it. What do you think about this topic, you know, um, buying black dolls with natural hair um, as a black woman, black mother for your child? All right. Thanks so much for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.